Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Holy Redeemer High School Virtual Spring Senior Night 2020. Baseball team, and we're going to say a little quote from Coach Ritzik. Hello, gentlemen, it's Coach Ritzik here. Just wanted to take a minute to thank you for a great three years. I know this wasn't the finish we were looking for, but hopefully we can look at all the good times the last three years have given us, from 6 a.m. Saturday workouts to building ledges at Hollenbach National. It's given us all many great memories. So to all my seniors, P.D. O'Shea, Conway, Dalton, Half Court Shop Marty, Jake, Ryan, Carl, Sam, Jacob, and of course Mick, I thank you all for everything you have given to the baseball program. Good luck to all of you in the future. First up, we have Colin Conway. His parents are Lori and Mike Conway, and he has a brother, Michael. His athletic accomplishments are playing baseball from 7th grade through 11th grade and two weeks of his senior year. He was a 2019 Comeback Player of the Year Award winner and a 2019 American Legion State Champion. His hobbies include lifting, video games, jigsaw puzzles. His favorite athlete is Chase Utley. His favorite memory is Sam Oley single-handedly beating the entire MMI team in a dance-off. His advice for future Royals is don't be the kid who doesn't wear a beanie to the annual beanie practice. His future plans are to attend Moravian College where he will play football. Congratulations, Colin Conway. Next up, we have Martin Cryan. His parents are Sean and Allison Cryan. His siblings are Casey, Abby, and Keegan. Athletic accomplishments, four years varsity golf, one year Wyoming Valley West, and three years at Holy Redeemer. He's a four-time individual district qualifier, qualified for regionals as a senior, won the conference championship as a sophomore, received the coach's award as a junior, and he four years of varsity ice hockey with the Wyoming Valley West Spartan High School our ice hockey team, and two years the Holy Redeemer baseball team. His hobbies include hanging out with friends, skiing, running, and bowling. His favorite athletes, Lamar Jackson. His favorite memory, sophomore year, being in computer apps one question row. Advice for future Royals, work hard, have fun, and enjoy every second because the time flies. His future plans are to attend Penn State University Park and major in finance or accounting. Congratulations, Martin Cryan. Next up, we have next up we have Jacob Gibbon. His parents are Rodney and Mary Gibbon. His athletic accomplishments are a four-year member of the Royal Baseball Team. His hobbies include hunting, fishing, and hanging out with friends. His favorite athlete is Pete Rose. Favorite memory is the arena basketball games. Advice for future Royals is high school is only four years long. Make it a good time. And his future goals are to join the Air Force. Congratulations, Jacob Gibbon. Our next senior is Sam Oley. Sam's parents are Ann Oley and Mark Oley. His siblings include Nick and Lou. And he has a dog, Daisy. His athletic accomplishments are being part of the Royals baseball team for four years. His hobbies include video games, piano, and watching movies. His favorite athlete is Derek Rose. His favorite memory is winning Spirit Games his senior year. Advice for future Royals is try new things. And his future goals include enjoying college and making money. Congrats, Sam Oley. Our next senior is Dalton Preston. Dalton's parents are Tammy Preston, and he has a dog, Steel. Athletic accomplishments include sophomore year letter and junior year lettering for the baseball teams. His hobbies include Eagle Scout, likes to spend time with his friends, and likes spending time with his family. His favorite athlete is Joel Embiid. Favorite memory, hosting a tailgate outside of Holy Redeemer Gymnasium before the varsity basketball game. His advice for future Royals include, at all times, be yourself no matter what comes your way. Stay dedicated to your goals, and it will get you to where you want to be. His future includes going to college at Drexel University to achieve a master's degree in civil engineering. Next up, we have Jake Roguski. His parents are Charlie and Sean Roguski, and his dog's name's Jeter. 
His athletic accomplishments include varsity lettering for his sophomore and junior years for baseball. Hobbies are producing music, playing video games, and spending time with his homies. Favorite athlete is Jimmy Rollins. Favorite memory is being selected as fan of the week by the Citizens Voice for destroying his voice in the Red Sea during a big win against Hanover area. Advice for future roles include make as many friends as possible and cherish each moment you are able to spend with them. His future is including attending Belmont University in Nashville, Tennessee, and graduate with a bachelor's degree in audio engineering and music business. Congratulations, Jake Roguski. Next, next up, we have Peter Shea. His parents are Michael and Christine, and his siblings are Erica and Brandon. His athletic accomplishments are three-year varsity winner in baseball and football. His hobbies include playing video games and enjoying the outdoors. His favorite athlete is Roberto Clemente. Favorite memory are all the memories he's made during football and baseball seasons. His advice for future Royals is definitely get involved with numerous activities and clubs and just have fun. His future will include majoring in computer science and minoring in business at King's College and hopefully land a good job right out of college. Congratulations, Peter Shea. Next up, we have Mickey Ticha. His parents are Herb and Anna Ticha. His athletic accomplishments are being three years of the baseball team. His hobbies include running and playing video games with friends. His favorite athlete is Kevin Kiermaier. His favorite memory is being a part of the Red Sea. His advice for future Royals is do as much as you can while you still can. And his future plans are to attend the University of Central Florida and major in mechanical engineering. Congratulations, Mickey. Next up, we have Ryan Williams. His parents are Tom and Colleen Williams, and his siblings are Tom and Sarah. His athletic accomplishments are football team captain his junior and senior years, a varsity letter winner his sophomore, junior, and senior years for football, and varsity letters for baseball, both sophomore and junior years, including when varsity football MVP award is junior year. His hobbies include hanging out with his friends, playing video games, and cat juggling. His favorite athlete is Jason Peters. His favorite memory is my favorite sports memory of Hall Redeemer is coming back to beat Columbia Montour Votech in football at King's College McCarthy Stadium. His advice for future Royals is work hard and cherish your friendships. His future plans are to attend Penn State University and study finance. Congratulations, Ryan Williams. And last but not least, we have Carl Yastrzemski. Carl and Sandy Yastrzemski are his parents. He has a sister, Paige, and a dog, Max. His athletic accomplishments are playing baseball Hall Redeemer 7th, 8th grade years, his freshman, sophomore, and junior years, and this year's senior year. He lettered his sophomore year and his junior year in baseball. He was the MVP of the freshman baseball team and played basketball for two years. His hobbies include the American Legion baseball team, travel baseball, student leadership, senior class president, and spending time with his friends. His favorite athlete is Tom Brady. His favorite, athlete, or his favorite memory is attending the basketball games in the Red Sea. His advice for future Royals is cherish every moment you have with your teammates and classmates because you never know when it will be your last. His future plans are to attend King's College where he will study accounting and play baseball there. Congratulations, Carl Yastrzemski. Next up, we have our Royal softball team. And first we have a message from coaches Jerry, JB, and Joe. Alicia, Ashanti, and Meredith. Even though your senior season was cut short, in the few weeks we were together, the three of you showed great leadership, determination, and hard work to us and your team. Don't let these circumstances dictate your high school softball career. You have won many championships the last few years. Remember all the fun that you had. Remember all the friendships that were made. Remember that life will throw you many curveballs, and in per persevering through this, you can accomplish anything you set your mind to. Although this is not how we imagined our season, you know that you had a successful high school career. We, the coaching staff, wish you the best of luck on your future endeavors and are always here for you. Good luck and God bless. And now for our softball seniors. First, Meredith Baird. Meredith's parents are Donna Graytock Baird and David Baird, and he has a brother, DJ. She has a brother, DJ. Athletic accomplishments, three-year softball player, varsity softball player with being a two-year letter recipient, 
2017 softball state runner-up, and 2017 softball district champion. Four-year letter winner and recipient of the field hockey team, 2016 state final four field hockey, junior and senior captain field hockey, all state honorable mention in field hockey, and the PHSFFHC academic award for field hockey. Her hobbies include baking, watching movies, hanging out with friends when not in quarantine, and listening to music. Also loves spending time with her brother and playing sports. Favorite athletes are J.J. Watt and Morgan Benkowski. Favorite memories, having a police escort for the softball state playoff game at Penn State. Advice for future Royals, the only place where success comes before work is in the dictionary. Practice like it's a game and always give 110%. Her future plans are to play field hockey and attend Allegheny College while majoring international business with a minor in Spanish. Congratulations, Meredith Baer. Next up, we have Ashanti Leon. Parents are Bethany Apunt and Fritz Leon. Siblings are Christian and Brianna. Hobbies include reading, baking, listening to music, arts and crafts, and watching TV. Favorite athlete is Kobe Bryant. Favorite memory is being a part of the costume crew for the play. Advice for future Royals is chase after your dreams. Don't let anyone put you down. Future plans are major in early childhood education. Congratulations, Ashanti. Last but not least, Alicia Pekarovsky. Parents are Bill and Susan Pekarovsky, and she has a sister, Kayla. Softball accomplishments. Played three years on varsity team, district champions her sophomore year, and state runners-up her sophomore year. Basketball varsity captain her senior year, played four years of varsity, district champion her freshman year, district runner-up sophomore, junior, and senior years, Wyoming Valley Conference champions her junior year. Hobbies include playing softball, playing basketball, hanging out with friends, crocheting, and social distancing. Favorite athlete is Emmett Smith. Favorite memory is going to Penn State for the softball state championship game her sophomore year and getting to play at the arena four years in a row for basketball. Advice for future Royals is don't take anything for granted and live every moment to the fullest because you never know what can happen. Future plans are to attend King's College for three years and the University of Notre Dame for two years to pursue a degree in chemical engineering. Congratulations, Alicia. Next up, we have our Royal Tennis team. First, a little quote from Coach Shahusky. Congratulations and good luck to Brandon and Rocco. Three great seasons with Brandon and one with Rocco. I'm sure this would have been a great season as well. Good luck in the future. First, first up, we have Brandon Gabenis. Parent is Nicole Zaruda. Like athlete accomplishes, member of the Holy Redeemer tennis team for four years. Hobbies include member of the National Honor Society, PJAS, and Science Olympiad. Future goals are currently undecided regarding which college or university to attend. And next up, we have Rocco Paglazi. Parents are David and Kim Paglazi, and sister is Sarah. Athletic accomplishments include a member of the Holy Redeemer soccer team for four years and a member of the Holy Redeemer tennis team, sophomore and senior years. Hobbies include performing in theatrical productions, playing sports, video games, hanging out with friends, and playing guitar. Favorite athlete is Lionel Messi. Favorite memory is winning the conference title for soccer his freshman year. His advice for future Royals is enjoy your time and be yourself. His future plans are to attend college to pursue, pursue musical theater. Congratulations, Rocco. Next, we have our Holy Redeemer track and field team. First, we have a quote from Coach Kev. To all the Holy Redeemer seniors, my heart goes out to you and your families at this time. To our track and field seniors, I have watched you become some amazing young men and women. If you push yourselves as hard as you did in your track and field careers, you will be successful in everything you do. I am so proud of you all and so honored to have coached you. Stay safe and God bless you and your families. First up, we have Destiny Andes. Parents are Michelle and Chuck Andes and has a sister Cameron. Athletic accomplishments are six years running and qualify for districts three years. Hobbies include hanging out with friends, running, reading, and dancing. 
Favorite athlete is Marley Starlipper. Favorite memory is during Shrek Tech Week, costume crew would order food and we would sit in the weight room and talk. Advice for future Royals is cherish every moment that you get. Future plans are to study psychology and attend Penn State University. Congratulations, Destiny Andes. Next up, we have Carly Cavanaugh. Parents are Mary Lou and Terry Cavanaugh. Her sister is Nicole, and they have a dog named Buttons. Athletic accomplishments are she has ran track for five years, received the coach's award her freshman year. She, ran, she competed second place in the 4x400-meter relay her sophomore year, third place in the 4x100-meter relay her junior year, and was also district champion her junior year. Hobbies include running, playing soccer, drawing, and hanging out with friends. Her favorite athlete is Julie Ertz. Her favorite memory, being able to participate in Holy Redeemer Athletics and Scholastics for four years. Her ad advice for future Royals is savor the time with your friends and family because it truly does fly by. Her future plans are to attend Misericordia University and play soccer. Congratulations, Carly. Next up, we have Ethan Segalka. His parents are Jackie and Jerry Segalka, and his siblings are Shane and Tessa. This would have been Ethan's first year on the track team. His hobbies include running, skiing, and hanging out with friends. His favorite athlete is Marcus Rashford. His favorite memory is winning the soccer conference championship his freshman year. Advice for future Royals is plan out your day and keep track of homework. His future plans are to attend Penn State University for computer science. Congratulations, Ethan. Next up, we have Jack Dowd. His parents are Wadia and Dalia Aldowd, and his siblings are Joseph and Anthony. His athletic accomplishments are lettering in track and field for two years and lettering in football for two years. His hobbies include working out and playing video games. His favorite athlete is Saquon Barkley. His advice for future Royals is be patient with the process, and his future plans are to attend college. Congratulations, Jack Dowd. Next, we have Joe Delaney. His parents are Christine and Michael Delaney, and his brother is Casey. His athletic accomplishments are four-year member of the cross-country team, winning a PIAA District 2 championship medal and being a state qualifier. He's also a four-year member of the track and field program, being a junior high captain. He's a 2016 Most Dynamic Athlete Award for track and the 2016 Most Viable Runner Cross Country. He's also a two-time Wyoming Valley Conference champion. His hobbies include running, baseball, video games, hunting, hiking, and spending time with friends and family. His favorite athlete is Derek Jeter. His favorite memory is having the whole conference count us out this cross-country season due to our team graduating most of our runners and us tying for the title pushing through adversity. His advice for future Royals is no matter what you do, regardless if it's sports or schooling, give everything you have to give and just when you think you're done, give more. His future plans are to attend Mansfield University to continue his athletic and academic careers and major in sports communication. Congratulations, Joe Delaney. Next we, next, we have Jimmy Dunleavy. His parents are James and Danielle Dunleavy, and his siblings are Nick, Nina, and Ella. This would have been his first year on the track team, but he's also a four-year member of the varsity soccer team, being a two-year captain. His hobbies include working out, hanging out with friends, playing soccer, watching movies, and eating Jerry's. Favorite athlete is Paulo Dybala. His favorite memory is winning the conference championship his freshman year for soccer. His future advice for future Royals is play as many sports as possible. His goals for the future are to study finance at Penn State University. Congratulations, Jimmy Dunleavy. Next, we have Caton Fahey. Parents are Michael and Arden Fahey. Siblings are Chad and Cade. And dogs are Tank and Xena. Athletic accomplishments, four-year field hockey letter winner, four-year track and field letter winner, including multiple medals and a state qualifying time. Hobbies include playing basketball. Favorite athlete is Michael Jordan. Favorite memory is when Coach Kev called Western Wayne's 4x400 A team their B team. 
Advice for future royals is work hard. Next year, she'll be at Monmouth University, where she'll play field hockey and study athletic training. Congratulations, Kate and Faye. Next up, we have Abby Lipinski. Her parents are Tracy and Barry Lipinski, and she has a sister, Brooke. Also has a cat, Oreo, and a dog, Piper. Her athletic accomplishments. Six-year member and two-year captain of the track and field team who consistently medaled in her events such as the 100 hurdles, long jump, triple jump, 200-meter dash, 400-meter dash, and 4x400-meter relay. She holds the title of 2018 district runner-up in 4x4-meter relay, 2019 district champion in the 4x400-meter relay, 2019 district long jump sixth place, and 2019 district 400-meter dash third place and 2019 District Girls Team Champion. Last year, her season ended with being the lead leg in the 4x400-meter relay that currently holds the District 2 record and placed second at the PIAA State Championships. Her hobbies include hanging out with friends, running, skiing, babysitting, tutoring, baking, and volleyball. Her favorite athlete is Sydney McLaughlin. Her favorite memory is spending a couple of days at Shippensburg during States. Her advice for future Royals is take in every moment because one day you will miss going to Relay for Life track without your best friends. Her goals for the future are to attend Pennsylvania State University to study nursing and continue her education to become a pediatric oncology nurse practitioner. Congratulations, Abby Lipinski. Next up, we have Cameron Marcinkowski. Her parents are Chrissy and Brian Marcinkowski, and she has a sister, Lexi. Her athletic accomplishments, she ran two years of track her freshman year and junior year. In her freshman year, she was a 4x800 relay team that placed fourth at the PIAA district race. Her junior year, she placed third in the 1600 at the PIAA district race and was the 2019 district champion in the 3200. She moved on to states in the 3200 and placed 14th at the state competition at Shippensburg University. She's also selected for the Citizens Voice Track and Field All-Star team her junior year. Her hobbies include running, swimming, biking, occasional just dance competitions with her sister, and sleeping. Favorite athlete is Shaquille O'Neal. Favorite memory is making the friendships and memories throughout every sports season. Advice for future Royals is always enjoy every practice, meet, game, etc. Never take anything for granted because time flies. Make sure to always have fun and love what you are doing. Her future plans are to attend Misericordia University to continue her academic and athletic career in cross country and track and field and major in nursing. Congratulations, Cameron Marcinkowski. Next up, we have Lauren Mullery. Her parents are Gerald and Michelle Mullery, and she has three siblings, Leah, Liam, and Loudon. Her athletic accomplishments are a member of the track and field team for two years, placing fifth in the shot put and discus at districts her sophomore year, placing fourth in shot put and sixth in districts her junior year, and won the District 2 team championships in 2019. Her hobbies include weightlifting and working out, drawing, singing, and playing the ukulele, spending time with her friends and family. Her favorite athlete is Aaron Madsen, who is an Olympic field hockey player. Favorite memory is winning the District 2 championship. Advice for future Royals is enjoy every moment because it goes by quicker than you think. Her future plans are to attend Lock Haven University to play field hockey and major in education. Congratulations, Lauren Mullery. Next up, we have Nick Pico. His parents are Larry and Marie, and he has a sister, Lauren. His athletic accomplishments are four years track and field team and member of the 2019 state 4x800 meter team. His hobbies include fishing and playing the guitar. His favorite athlete is Sam Parsons. His favorite memory is placing fifth as a team in cross country states and going to track states the year in the 4x800 meter, meter relay his junior year. His advice for future Royals is enjoy high school. His future plans are to major in civil engineering at Lehigh University. Congratulations, Nick Peekle. Next up, we have our Holy Redeemer vo boys volleyball team. First, we have a quote from Coach Kavlik. 
To Jared, Luigi, and Nate, the anticipation and the lofty goals we all had coming into this season from winning another league and district championship and proving ourselves at two of the toughest tournaments in the state, along with our lofty goal of a state title, were all cut short by something we couldn't beat. And believe me, seniors, all of our goals were attainable. Good luck in your future endeavors in which I am sure you will all succeed. Now for our boys volleyball team. First up, Jared Poinkowski. His parents are Ralph and Danielle Poinkowski. His brothers are Matt and Seth, and he has dogs Pixie and Duncan. His athletic accomplishments are basketball, four years of high school. His, he was captain his junior and senior years, two-time District 2 runner-up, one-time District 2 champion. His volleyball accomplishments, two years and would have been three. Two-time District champion, 2019 All-State team, 311 kills his sophomore year, 601 kills his junior year, Citizens Voice MVP his junior year, and two-time All-District First Team member. Hobbies include playing sports, playing card games, watching TV, eating, taking naps, taking, talking and hanging out with friends, playing with his two dogs. His favorite athlete is Giannis Antetokounmpo. Favorite memory is winning the 8th and ninth consecutive district championships for Holy Redeemer's volleyball team. His future advice for Royals are never take anything for granted. His future plans are to attend King's College, to major in business, finance, and to continue his athletic career playing volleyball. Congratulations, Jared Poinkowski. Next up, we have Luigi Romano. His parents are Teresa Cordigone Romano and Luigi Romano, and his sister Izzy. His athletic accomplishments are four-year of boys volleyball and being a captain during the 2020 season. His hobbies include gaming, chauffeur for, Liz for Izzy, hanging out with friends, and being part of the hooligans. Advice for future Royals is be your own person and worry only about things you can change. His future goals are to attend King's College and major in personal finance and accounting. Congratulations, Luigi Romano. And lastly, we have Nate Rappel. His parents are Kristen and Bob Rappel, and his dog Tanner is a golden doodle. Athletic accomplishments, three-year varsity winner for volleyball, one-year junior varsity member, two-year district champ, one-year conference champion, top serving points in the Miami Valley Conference in 2019. In football, he is a four-year varsity letter winner and starter and Division III runner-up in 2017. In soccer, he played his freshman year, and basketball, he also played his freshman year. His hobbies include going to the gym, watching Netflix, the Boy Scouts, camping and hiking, traveling, eating at Moe's, and fine dining. His favorite athlete is Lamar Jackson. His favorite memory is winning the Volleyball District Championship in 2019. His advice for future Royals is get involved and become as much of a part as you can. Holy Redeemer offers amazing sports and clubs. Never take it for granted. It can be cut short at any moment. His future plans are to attend Washington and Jefferson College to major in neuroscience and play football for the Presidents. Congratulations, Nate Rappel. So that concludes our 2020 Spring Sports Virtual Senior Night. I want to thank everyone who has helped put this video together and want to thank especially all of our senior spring athletes at this time. I know it wasn't the ideal way to finish off your careers as Holy Redeemer Royals, but just know that you've all had a very lasting impression on all of us, your faculty, your staff, your members of the Holy Redeemer community, and know that we're all very proud of you and honored that you have been Holy Redeemer Royals. And please come visit us anytime. Now I'm going to pass this over to our principal, Mrs. Dockerty. Spring Athletes Class of 2020, we want to thank you all for the memories you've given us over the past years. Whether you've participated on Holy Redeemer Spring Sports for one year or the last three, you have certainly made a lasting impression. And we want to thank you for your dedication, hard work, and most of all, always bringing pride to the Royals. You will always be part of the Royal community. Come back to visit. And once again, Thanks for the memories.